Welcome back to the Travel Channel. It's January 2023 and we're doing another video today. We're in Jom Tien. Going past a few little bars here. They're quite quirky. And you can get a burger and chips in there quite cheap. I had one in there a while ago. It's quite a big burger actually. And we're going to take a little left along here in a minute. And we're going to be heading down towards Soy 5 again. As you know, I've already done a video there. But I've had someone ask me to do a video on Cheap Charlie's in Soy 5, Jom Tien. Well, there used to be Simple Simon's down there. And they did a good breakfast for about just over 100 baht. But Cheap Charlie's, they seem to do the cheapest breakfast in Pattaya and Jom Tien. So the price of a full breakfast in Cheap Charlie's is 89 baht, about two pounds and five p. Really, really cheap. But is it any good? Apparently you get a full English breakfast in there. You can have fried eggs or scrambled eggs. And you get a coffee and you get a fruit juice. Well, if you can get all that lot for two quid, then it's gonna be absolutely amazing. And they've also got a sports TV in there. That's like a little bit of a sports bar, so you can watch your sport as well. Well, that seems quite incredible. So we're gonna check it out. Because as you know, in England now at Starbucks, you pay £3.50 for a coffee. And apparently you get a fruit juice as well here with your coffee and a full breakfast with toast and everything. So I've had a few people ask me, could I review it? Is the breakfast any good? So that's exactly what I'm gonna to do today. You know, when there's an old saying go, you pay peanuts, you get monkeys. Maybe in England, but not in Thailand. A breakfast fully cooked for two quid. Where in England you pay your equivalent to nine pound fifty or in somewhere like the Premier Inn, more like £18.50. So we're gonna get on a back bus in a minute. We're very, very close to the beach here. And we're gonna get off a back bus at Soy 5. And we're gonna check out Cheap Charlie's. There's another one as well in Pattaya. But we're gonna do the one in Jom Tien. I've been told it's always busy in there. So uh, I'm quite hungry as well. So I'm going to see what we can get for two quid. You can't buy much for that sort of money these days. You just imagine it's in a restaurant. You're going to sit down. They're going to serve you. They're going to cook the food for you. They're going to do all the washing up for you. And they're going to charge you two pounds. Well, just at the end of this road here is the beach. That's where I'm going to get a back bus in a minute. Sorry about a camera shake. I've got a, a bag on there I'm carrying today, so it's getting in the way of a camera. It's a little bit run down. Some of these soys leading down to the beach are a little bit run down. We're very close now to the beach. So I'm going to do a few updates for you later. First update you want to know is what's the weather like today in the beginning part of January? Well, it is 33 degrees today and it has a fuel factor of 35. A little bit down on yesterday, but it's still hot. We're in England. I hear you got a lot of rain. Apparently it's warmed up a little bit in England now the minus fives, sixes and the minus sevens are gone. And you've got about 10 degrees there now, but it's still cold. Right there again, it is January. Right, we're gonna cross over this busy road now and wait for a back bus. 
they come along every sort of five ten minutes it's 10 baht which is 19p and it'll take you wherever you want even to Pattaya but we're going to go just past the John Tian night market and we'll be getting off at the Soy 5 big bank here so we're just going to have a little look around here while we're waiting it's quite busy on this road I've got to admit yeah, the back buses come up and down from Pattaya to Jom Tien. Oh, look at this. Selling brushes. I've seen it all now. Little motorbike and sidecar selling household brushes. Their brushes out here are a bit weird. They're not like the ones we use in England, which are like a stiff broom. These ones are on a stick with a like a fan looking uh, brush. I've uh, used one at my apartment and not very easy to get on with to be honest with you but the ties know how to use them little family mark there you can get anything you want your ice cold drinks in there Fanta's and Coca-Cola a bottle which will cost you about 15, 16 baht not expensive there's quite a few banks along this road on Jom Tien you've got this one here and you've got a Cassie Corn look at these brushes See the things they got on these little motorbike and sidecars out here? It's quite amazing. I'm building my appetite up now. Here's my back bus. Let's get on here. Jump on. This one's not hanging around. Yeah, I can't feel much while we're on here for obvious reasons. But I'll be getting off in a minute. So I'll probably cut a little bit of this out. Right, let's go and pay the man the 10 baht. 10 baht through the window. Thank you, sir. Right, now we've got to cross over this road now. And this is the soy we want, the soy 5. I've already filmed it a bit for you. It's where immigration is. The cheap Charlie's just down here on the left-hand side. Tattoo place here on the right. And there's a mobility scooter place here as well. well I'll try and get you better footage of Cheap Charlie. So you are, there's a sign here on the left. It's quite a wide building. It's a nice little soy this. So let's see how good this breakfast is for 89 baht. I'm not expecting a lot to be honest. I buy a lot of breakfasts out here, but I normally pay about three quid or three and a half quid, but this is two quid. There you go, that's Cheap Charlie's. Let's go in and see if we can get a seat. It looks quite busy in here. But there again, it will be, won't it, if the breakfasts are only two quid. Right, let's go and... Oh, it is busy. Right, let's see if I can find a seat. Ah, yes, I found one. Let's sit down and see what the service is like. There you go. Two sausages, two bacon. There's my toast. Cheap Charlie's password for the Wi-Fi, all the sauces. There's my fruit juice. There's my coffee and a Cheap Charlie's cup. Two bacon, tomato, two sausages, two bacon, and scrambled egg. Wow. And a sports TV in the background. Still got the decorations up, they don't take them down to about 14 days after. Little pack butter, sarsen's vinegar, even got toothpicks. There you go. Eat the whole lot for you. Absolutely amazing. 89 baht, two pounds. Absolute no brainer. So, how would I rate it out of 10? Well, for value for money, it's got to be a 10. Was it tasty? Again, 10. I couldn't fault it, to be honest with you. Probably on par or better than the three quid breakfasts I've been buying, so thumbs up for me. Definitely. Well, I'm going to be bringing this video to an end shortly now. If you enjoyed it, give it a thumbs up please share it with your friends 
please subscribe if you haven't already and click on the black notification bell and you will get free notifications as soon as I put up my next video. This is a travel man from the travel channel saying bye for now, stay safe, happy days and I'll see you in another video very very soon. Bye.